Right then, first of all, I'd like to welcome you all for coming. I know things have been strange at present and we've had to scale down so many things. Unfortunately for me, not my bill. <laughs> Jade and Tom have been planning their big day now for over 18 months and I'm so pleased for them for managing them to, them to have the ceremony in the church that means so much to our family. Also, I know it's traditional at this point to welcome the new son-in-law into the family, <laughs> which I would do when I get my chainsaw back, <laughs> my floodlights back, and a pitchfork. I'd also like to say how proud I am today and give my good try, and how beautiful she looks. So, <coughs> we try and keep it in there. I can see there are a lot of strangers in the room today who I'm not sure know each other. So I'll start by introducing myself. I'm James. I'm first born and favourite son to Dawn and Clive. Big brother and best man to Tom. It's safe to say over the years that together as brothers we've done and seen some very stupid things. And I've loved every minute of it. We've laughed and you've cried. I ate my Christmas dinner, you were being sick. Even on our very different career paths where you dig holes and I sit at home in my pants, we have a very unique and close relationship that I have no doubt will continue to excel. You're my bigger, little bro, my best friend and the best man to me too. Jade, a big warm welcome to the family. It really is a pleasure to have you on board and of all days, today you really do warrant the title of Jade the Babe, you look stunning. I'm sure by now you all know how we met. It's this really good game called Tinder. And basically you have to swipe as fast as you can right to try and complete the game. I'm on level 10. You're just on about level one, aren't you? You're just getting going. But luckily for me, Jade also liked what she saw when we matched. After speaking for a while, I picked up the Dutch coast to invite her for a coffee. I knew that she was in love with me as soon as she met me, because when we left the coffee shop, we were walking back and as she looked into my gorgeous eyes, I had to rugby tuck her out of the way of a lamppost before she had by it. <laughs> then fast forward to buying a house together. What an adventure it has been. From you telling me that I don't clean, I tidy, and there's a clear difference between the two. Thank you for making our house a home, with all the little touches, like a random bloody duck wearing wellies on the windowsill. And the fact that one minute we're talking about the possibility of getting a dog, I go out, put the kettle on, and you tell me you put a deposit down. <laughs> but we wouldn't change it for the world. Thank you for always believing in me and picking me up when I get down, no matter if it's from not going to work or being injured from hockey. I always know you'll be there to pick me up and kick me up the arse to get me going again. We haven't had the easiest of years for so many reasons, but no matter what this year has thrown at us, we've battled our way through it and come out the other side stronger. That's why we make such a good team, and it makes me so happy to be able to spend the rest of my life with my best friend. So here's to the future, here's to the memories, the laughs and the fun, and most important to us. Tom's a very lucky man. I speak mainly on behalf of my parents and their fridge, and I thank you for being the catalyst that made Tom finally leave home at the ripe age of 25. You've also enabled Tom to watch Pingu when he can and get an Ocado delivery when it suits. <laughs> Tom, well and you Jade, I don't think anyone here is more happy than our parents to see you both get married. And if there's one thing we can take from our parents, it's not how much porridge is too much porridge. <laughs> it's that even after 38 years of being together, 30th or of those married, that they're still as in love and as loyal as they've ever been. I'm very excited for the adventure you had ahead of both of you. With the bar due to close in a batch of hours and it being a school night, can you please all join me in toasting to my brother and my new sister-in-law, the bride and groom, Jane and Tom. <laughs> 